What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Second Accord. I just want to do a quick video um, talking about the <clears throat> ice cream sandwich update for the Samsung Galaxy Tab 7.0 Plus. Um, a lot of people um, got the update and the update is now official. It's, it's now officially in the US. You can go to Samsung Keys and download it if you want to. Um, a lot of people having issues with it and it's related to the Wi-Fi. The update itself is great. There's not too many bugs with it. I haven't noticed really any bugs with it. It runs smooth. Um, you know, everything is very, 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 very smooth. Um, it's a lot smoother, faster than Honeycomb. But I saw a lot of people having issues with the Wi-Fi, and the Wi-Fi tends to drop out a lot more than it did with Honeycomb. Um, with Honeycomb, you can get a signal. Keep a signal and it will stay steady. Um, with ice cream sandwich, the Wi-Fi just seems flaky. It it'll connect, it'll stay connected for a little bit, it'll drop out. Um, I tend to notice most of the issues when the tablet goes to sleep. If the screen turns off, it goes to sleep. Once you turn it back on, it doesn't want to find a signal. Or I have noticed well, if you're in a hotspot or Wi-Fi that's not very strong, it tends it tends to drop out at times and then try to come back on, but it has trouble reconnecting. That's usually what the issue is. If it drops out even for a second, it has trouble reconnecting. Um, so I'm going to show you guys a little trick, and hopefully this will help. If it doesn't help. Um, please leave in the comment if it does help or if it doesn't. Leave a comment, and we're gonna try to get a dialogue going and see if we can get this thing worked out. Um, but I did notice that the Wi-Fi settings on Honeycomb were different. Uh, there was a different default than it is an ice cream sandwich. So what we're gonna do is once you're on your home screen, your home screen is going to going, going to look different, but it doesn't matter. What you need to do is you need to go to your notification bar. And go into settings, which is at the very top, underneath your volume. And right at the top, first page, you're going to have a little icon up in the upper right. You're going to hit that icon, and you're going to go to the advanced. Once you're in the advanced menu here, you're going to have keep Wi-Fi on during sleep. On the Honeycomb firmware, that was... The default on that was always, but now on ICS the default is never. So I already changed changed mine. But if you hit that option, you're gonna have a couple of options. You're gonna have always on and put it in never. Um, go ahead and put it on always. And what this is gonna do is once your tablet goes to sleep, it will keep the Wi-Fi on. It'll keep it on all the time. It'll keep it on when it's when it's sleeping and when the screen's off, the Wi-Fi will stay connected. So that theoretically should help with the disconnecting part when it disconnects and it, won't, it can't reacquire the um, Wi-Fi. So try that. And I want you guys to leave me a comment. Anybody on my channel, anybody watching the video that has a Samsung Galaxy Tab Plus, is having any issues with the Wi-Fi, uh, try that trick and leave a comment to see if that helps with your Wi-Fi. If it does, then you know, then maybe the fix is that simple. You know, maybe it's just a just a setting. Um, hopefully it is. But if it's not, um, you know, we can get a, a, a long dialogue going. Samsung's not very good at releasing updates. Um, you know. They'll probably release update if it's widespread, but it's you know very they're they're kind of slow. You know, I wouldn't say that if we do see update, we're not going to see one for at least a few months. So if you're on Honeycomb and you're debating whether to go to ICS or not, if you're in a place that maybe doesn't have a strong signal, you know, it's it's your your decision whether you want to upgrade or not. At my house here again, I have a super strong Wi-Fi signal. I don't have any issues. Um, 
when I'm at work, sometimes the signal gets kind of flaky, and that's when my tab will just disconnect. And I'll have to toggle Wi Fi off and then on. It's the only way, a lot of the times, the Wi Fi will turn back on is you have to toggle it off and then back on. It won't it won't reconnect by itself. And that's I think that's the issue that most people are are having. Um the only downfall to that setting is that your battery life will be um it will decrease your battery life because your Wi Fi is not turning off. Um usually when the tab goes asleep with that the setting being never, as soon as the screen goes off after about twenty to thirty seconds, um the Wi Fi will shut off. And then you're not drawing any power, so your standby time should be increased. So this will decrease your standby time, um, but it hopefully will increase your Wi-Fi. So leave a comment below. Let me know if it works. Let me know if it doesn't work, and we'll go from there. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Um, go ahead and check out my channel. I have lots of videos on the Galaxy Tab 7.0 Plus. Um, also, have videos that before you touch, a couple on the Camel Fire. So, you know, any questions, leave a comment. Check out my channel. If you like my channel, go ahead and subscribe. It's Second Accord. I'm out.